the the Christian revolution is based on a love which excludes no single human being. Jesus, after all, enfleshed himself as one of our peasants to share their miseries. Can we call ourselves his followers and not do the same? Rutilo Grande. On March 12, 1977, his death transformed the life of Oscar Romero. There was an inexorable spirit moving through El Salvador at the time, and the mouth of Romero was opened on behalf of those in greatest need in El Salvador. His heart was deeply moved by the oppression that was endured by the people of El Salvador, and he used his place of power, used his voice of privilege, used his position of authority to speak truth to the powers that would soon silence him. Those who would save their lives, that is, those who would want to get along, who don't want commitments, who don't want problems, who want to stay outside of a situation that demands the involvement of all of us, they will lose their lives. What a terrible thing to have lived quite comfortably with no suffering, quite tranquil, quite settled with good connections. To what end? Romero Center Ministries hopes to echo this challenging spirit in a time where the gap between the rich and the poor seem unfathomable, where the unemployment rate aches on at destructive rates, where the foreclosure of homes forces families onto the street, where political giants play war games with the lives of women and children across the world where the exploitation of labor is commonplace for our way of life. We are called to speak on behalf of those suffering in this world. Oscar Romero's voice spoke to the need to challenge ourselves to live a life fruitful, especially in places of death throughout our society. Romero Center Ministries invites you to join us for the anniversary of Oscar Romero's assassination this month by engaging your mind and heart in a new way. Our annual Romero Lecture Series this year focuses on the political life of Christians. This Politics in the Pews discussion will offer a new and imaginative way of thinking from our keynote speaker, Dr. Stephen Schneck, the Director for the Institute of Policy Research and Catholic Studies from Catholic University. It would be our pleasure to share in the spirit of Oscar Romero with you on Friday, March 23rd at Rutgers Camden University campus. Brothers and sisters, God's word calls us to this today. Let me tell you with all the conviction that I can muster, it is worthwhile to be a Christian.